welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. This is a particularly exciting video as this is the week my gorgeous River Blue turns five. I honestly don't know how how is this happening how is my baby five already i do not know but anyways we're doing a birthday party for her on sunday and her actual birthday is on monday lots of exciting things to prepare for this week we've got a face painting station we've got birthday presents to wrap we've got a blue arch to make a birthday cake to make and i am not a good baker that's for sure. So I thought you, I'd bring you guys along with me. So sit back and relax and enjoy. So first things first, I have just had a delivery and it is a very exciting present. You are gonna die when you see this. This is River Blue all over. Look at this Wednesday Adam's dress. <gasps> I am gonna have the happiest daughter in the world and it no lie comes with a matching wig she is gonna freak out when she sees this guys so today is tuesday um and the aim of today is to find wrapping paper for river's presents and to get a good solid plan written up for the birthday cake i was gonna give you a little bit of a sneak peek a little bit of a clue of what the vibe's gonna be with the cake but you know what it's probably going to go wrong. I know that's not the attitude, but it is probably going to go wrong. So I'm not going to show you. I will just show you the final piece when we get there actually on her birthday. But that is the aim for today. I'm about to go meet mum and Paul for coffee. Then we're going to go and find some wrapping paper. And I'm going to get a really good solid plan ready for her actual birthday cake. <laughs> I honestly just had the time of my life in Home Bargains. The man on the till said, does somebody like pink? I was like, yes, my daughter's birthday. Um, so I got some wrapping paper, which is what I went in there for. Rain's just woke up, brilliant. Um, I got princess wrapping paper and a Minnie Mouse wrapping paper. And I got birthday cards, Minnie Mouse, sister birthday card, and a Peppa Pig daughter birthday card. And a gorgeous birthday badge that I thought she would be able to wear to school because, let's face it, she's going to absolutely love the idea of telling everybody it's her birthday. So that was kind of for her birthday on the Monday to wear into school, that one. Now, when I was in there, I went in there for wrapping paper, obviously, but then I remembered I'm doing like kind of like a girly, pinky, like greys board where I'm just going to have all the food shoved on a massive tray. We've got guests around all day, and I thought, I don't have to worry about it then. I can just shove it all on a board, whack it on the table. Yeah. River will think it looks incredible when she walks in the house, and I don't have to feed everybody all day. They can just pick um, and grab stuff whenever people come, because they're coming in all different times. So I got some seriously, seriously cool stuff for this graze board. Let me show you. I honestly had the time of my life buying all of this stuff and I cannot wait to put it all together. So for the Grace Ward, first of all, I got some of these Mr. Kipling unicorn slices that she absolutely loves. I'll probably like chop these in half. Why can't I open them? I'll probably chop these in half and they'll just look really nice on the board. I got some fruit salad wafers probably taste disgusting but will look really good with the vibe some love heart sweeties barbie marshmallows how cool is that now i didn't know whether to get the cakey bits because obviously i'm going to be making a birthday cake but i thought they'd look really cool on the board some french fancies these are brilliant River Blue is going to be so chuffed with these. Little um, dummy lollies. Pink Panther, pink wafers. Again, I didn't know whether to get cakey bits, but I thought this chopped up to fill in the gaps on the board. A bit of Battenberg. I love Battenberg. I got two packets of these because I thought, oh my God, how incredible are they? Pink Panther, Twinkies, Pinkies. Again, they probably aren't really going to taste very nice, but they're going to look very cool. Um, she loves rainbow as well, so we've got some rainbow cookies. This is all looking so pink. Um, some pink 
mini meringues just to fill like any gaps. I thought they would be really cool. Some Barbie candy sticks. Does anyone else used to pretend these were cigarettes when you were younger? <laughs> Think you were really cool walking around smoking your fake candy cigarettes. Um, some of these, I know they're Oreo, but they're covered in white, so I thought they'd look really cool against the pink. Of course, I couldn't do a party for River without her favourite party ring, so I've got lots of them. I grabbed some of them for now because if you see those for under £2, I always grab them because River loves them. These are not for that either, but I got her some smoothies. Same with them. If you spot them for under £2 anywhere, always grab them. And these I thought were really cute. Jammy Dodgers. With unicorns on. So, yeah, it's uh, it's all looking very pink over here at the moment. I also got this from Home Bargains, actually, because I thought it was really cool. It's glittery Play-Doh. And at her party, we've got like a face painting station. She's asked me to do people's face paints, which is going to be hilarious. And I thought we'd have like a little Play-Doh station as well. I'm trying to think of like things to like have out for people to do whenever they um, rock up at whatever time it is. So I thought I'd have this out on the table, maybe a table outside if the weather's nice. They could do some glittery Play-Doh. I've never seen glittery Play-Doh before, so I thought it would be cool. Um, but yeah, that's everything I bought. I can't wait to see this whole thing put together on a board. It's going to look so cool. Oh my actual God. How cool is all of this? It is just pink heaven. River is going to be so happy when she sees all of this out. It is so cool. Yes. I'm really impressed with that. Go mummy. Mummy points for me. These are my favourite. So today is Wednesday and I'm on my way to Asda now to grab River's birthday cake ingredients. Sorry about the dangling dice, which I'm sure are driving you guys nuts. Um, I've come up with a really good plan for River's birthday cake. Whether the plan works or not is a different story. Like I said earlier, I'm not going to tell you because it's probably going to go tits up. Um, but positive thinking, positive thinking. I'm sure it's going to be absolutely freaking awesome. Um, yeah, it's basically just River and a cake. Wait until you see it. And if you know River, you will be like, she nailed it. If I nail it, obviously. Um, so yeah, go to Asda now to grab all the ingredients. It's going to cost me an arm and a bloody leg, but it's going to be worth it. I'm here when will you make your move? I am me, I want you, why don't you come to me, I can be, what do you need, oh baby? So I think that's everything I need to buy for River's birthday. Now I've just got to wrap all of her presents and make the birthday cake, which is the tricky part. But... I think I've got everything now. It's getting so excited. Look at this little cherub pie. So cute. Have you ever seen a cuter baby? So before we wrap it all up, let's just go through everything that we've got for the birthday girl. First of all, we've got this scooter, which is like a light up scooter. And I believe it's got like pom poms hanging off the handlebars. Now I'm not actually going to wrap this up because I quite like the idea of building it and then she just walks, no, do you know what, it doesn't even, I think I might have ordered the wrong one here, you know. I swear it at pom poms coming off the handlebars. Anyways, um, I'm going to, I'm not going to wrap this up, I'm just going to build it, pop a bow on it and then she can see that as soon as she walks in the room. Then we've got her Lush Bat Bombs, which I went through on another post, on another video with you guys. This is the box, and I filled it, oh my god, it smells absolutely gorgeous. I filled it with lots of bath bombs that I picked for her. This is my absolute favourite. This, like, Play-Doh bath bar. It's got, like, all different, oh my god, it smells so good. It's got, like, all different types of, like, 
baths, I think they're called bath soaps, but they're also play date. I'm not entirely sure. But anyways, they're all really, really cool, and she's gonna absolutely love them. She'll love the box alone. Then I've got, now some of this is a little bit random. There's a wrapping paper. We have a bubble wand, which she knows about. I picked this ages ago and she keeps finding it basically. She goes searching for it. Oh, there's another present actually upstairs, which I've hidden from her. It's a pencil case, a pop-up pencil case, which she picked as well ages ago. Um, she loves makeup, so I've got this cute little like lollipop makeup kit. I thought I'd get her some of her own kids' makeup. And then she won't wear mine all the time. So she's going to absolutely adore that. I thought this would be a good thing, actually, maybe to keep out to do on her birthday. Actually, yeah, I'm not going to wrap this. So it's a Barbie jewellery studio. I wanted, like, a couple of things to have out on the day for everybody to do. So I've got, like, some Play-Doh. I've got some face paint. And now I'm going to leave this out, I think, so everybody can make their own um, bracelet. Rivet will love being in charge of that. Um, cute scented lip balm. This is all from being um, um, home bargains now. Little lip balm there. Oh my god, look at these. She's gonna die when she sees these. Wait, how do I turn it on? They light up. There you go. Look at them. They flash. She keeps going, What am I gonna wear for Halloween, mummy? What am I gonna wear for Halloween? Well, you've got two choices, hun. You're gonna have a big cat. We could be Wednesday Adams. Um, a couple of other bath bombs which I got from Home Bargains. This one looks really good. It's got like a rainbow inside. And this one's got um, jewellery inside. But I'm thinking I might actually, now I've got her, the Lush bath bombs. I'm going to pop these away for Christmas. They're going to be the first stocking fillers. Ah! I can officially say I've started Christmas shopping now. Oh yeah. There's no point in giving her too many bath bombs. Then we've got some party decorations here oh no this is the face paint this is cool this she's gonna absolutely love this so it's got like some face paint ideas some gems some stencils including a halloween one actually it's quite cool and then we've got all the face paints here we've got some glitter and we've got this I love these you kind of like stab the sponge it and then you've got an instant rainbow so I'm quite looking forward to playing around with that actually because she is going to love that then this is oh we've just got some of the hangy like foil hanging foil basically just to go like between the doors and things when she walks in just to give it like a wow factor there is some balloons and stuff as well but I don't think they've made it downstairs Oh, I'm going to save that to last because that is really cool. Here's the Wednesday Adams dress, which I've already shown you guys. We're actually going to give that to her on her... So her party is on Sunday and her birthday is on the Monday. She's got school on the Monday, obviously. So we're going to give her all of her presents on the Monday morning before school. But we are, however, going to give her the Wednesday Adams dress on Sunday morning because, let's face it, she's going to want to wear that to the party, isn't she? Um, you've seen you've seen all of this actually in the other haul, but I'll just go for it again quickly. This is the Primark fluffy Jack Skeleton makeup bag, a really cute little fidget necklace, Wednesday Adams bag, and this absolutely beautiful river and blanket. How amazing is this? I'm not sure if it's catching how amazing that is on camera. But yeah, so that's it. I'm actually gonna get all of this wrapped up now. Where are those balloons that I bought? I ordered some balloons. Oh God, help me if I can't find them. I'm sure they're just upstairs. So. Oh, I didn't show you. This is elastic. This is so cool. Like seriously cool. Thing. Do I have a very own thing? Why can't I open the bag? It's actually pretty. Okay, that is actually disgusting. That is gross. It had like some manky fluff on it. She's got her own thing toy. She's gonna love that so much. Wait to get that way. Oh my gosh, she's literally gonna have so much. How random is this 
we've gone from bath bombs to a uh, like zombie hand thing. I don't know. Anyways, right, I'm going to wrap all this up now before Wayne wakes up. Oh, this is bonkers. Now I'm looking at all this. She is an absolute nut job, that kid. Absolute nutter. What the hell are these presents? Okay, so we are pausing the birthday prep. I have just had a vintage... What is my hair? Who knows? I have just had a vintage parcel be delivered. And this is from the one and only Eleanor Swift. I'm very excited about this. <laughs> She's literally like uploading stuff and people were buying it really, really quick. And I was like, no! I want an item of Ellie Darby's clothing! And I finally got one. Um, oh, look! How cute! Thank you, love, Elle. Ellie? Oh my god. So, I uh, basically, those of you who don't know who Ellie Swift is, why don't you? Um, I'm obsessed with her YouTube, old videos and new videos. And she's posted this PLT. I mean, I'm not going to be needing the shorts, am I? I basically just bought it for the shirt. It's just like a brown cord. Really, really nice. <sighs> Little cord there. Not going to be needing them, but I'm sure I'll be in them next year. What size was it? UK size 14. Perfect. So, yeah. I think it was a tenner for the whole cord. Vintage is amazing. So cute! It's so excited! Have you ever tried to butter toast one-handed? Try it! I dare you! Right guys, it's Saturday, which means it's officially cake making day! Oh god, I'm not sure I'm ready for this. I'm not sure my family's ready for this. Oh god, wish me luck. It's time. On your marks, get set, bake! Okay, this is the setup. All ready to start. How cute is this little five-year-old candle? I've got all my food colour in here. Um, it's a little bit of a clue of what I'm doing and then some black food colouring and I'm going to attempt some piping, <laughs> we all know how that's going to go, and some Smarties for the surprise part of the cake. Got a little helper helping me today as well, say hi Hughes. Hi. <laughs> making a cake fact just one look and I can hear a bell ring one more look and I forget everything oh whoa mamma mia okay cake update so the first three colors were incredible absolutely stunningly beautiful however the last three colors we've just done are not quite so bold and beautiful are they rain 
I think it's a blue food colouring. All of the ones that we put blue in, I'll show you. Look. Look at these colours. So bold. Yellow, orange and red. And then this is supposed to be purple. And that, yes, that is supposed to be bright blue. Oh, shut the front door. Right, this is proof now that it is the blue food colour in that is a piece of turd. This was like the bogeyest green in the world, wasn't it, boys? It was. And it's literally come out yellow. So everything we put blue in hasn't worked. Look how green the mixture of that is. It's fucking yellow. Boys, fill her up. Oh. Filled her up. <laughs> How many packets was that? All right. Three. <gasps> guys, look. <laughs> right, guys, I am well and truly done in now. That cake has taken up the entire day. The kids are driving me insane, as you'll be able to hear in the background. But the cake was made. It has been done. Mission has been completed. Um, and... I've just got to decorate for the party tomorrow and things like that, but I'll leave that for um, the actual River's birthday vlog. I'm knackered. <laughs> Had to pop out to the shop last minute because apparently making black food colouring is impossible. Literally impossible. Um, but apart from that, it was all actually pretty smooth sailing, actually. So, yeah. Um, yeah, that's it. Thank you for watching my vlog. And... <laughs> keep an eye out for river's birthday vlog which will be coming up soon um yeah that's it for me bye guys love you all thanks for watching